Today I have my fellow educator, Taylor. We are gonna be showing you how to do a half up, half down trendy pony. So first we wanna start with, this is just a pro tip, not detangling the hair because we wanna really keep a good fluffy look. And you would just take a little triangle section part. You can do this with your fingers. This is super easy. So you've got the fronts you can leave out if you'd like. Take your finger and go straight up from behind the ear, making sure that you're not snagging any of your wefts. You can grab a clip and get that side clipped up. And you're just gonna do the exact same thing on the other side of the head. Again, you can use your finger. It's probably safer to, to use your finger than a comb because you wanna make sure that you're not jamming up your wefts. Then all you have to do is take your hands, grab the other side, grab a brush, and again, you're gonna have the wefts pulled straight up at a 90 degree angle, but you wanna make sure that you're not pulling on your natural hair. Part of the row is gonna be coming down and part of it's gonna be going up. So now you wanna use your brush and you wanna gently brush over the wefts going straight up. If you wanna pull these up, then all you would do is just brush these back in with the rest of the pony. And then you can take any one of these hair ties, we're gonna go with brown, and these are just your non-metal elastics. We're gonna just wrap this around three times, and make sure you're not pulling too tight. If you feel any tension or pulling on your natural hair, don't worry, as soon as you get this together, you're just gonna take, hold your pony nice and tight, and then take your finger and just release that tension, release that pull, especially on the front where your wefts are connected to your hair. Don't be hung up on a tight, tight pony or a slick pony. We want the texture because that's just gonna give an added layer to the look. If you wanna elevate this look, you could take a piece of hair from underneath and wrap it around and secure this with a bobby pin. And up here you have no wefts, so you're, you don't have to be worried about snagging. Then you take this remaining hair and this is what is going to cover up your wefts. If you don't have a bobby pin, you're just gonna let that fall. And then this is the hair that covers up the sides. And that's it. 